Hi everyone, Rob Howitt, RJH Motorbike Training. Short video today as it's raining outside, pinlock visors. So who has suffered, who has experienced a fogged up visor when you're on the roads? We live in England, we live in the UK, we're a very tropical environment. So as soon as you get out on the bikes, fogs up visor, you can't see where you're going. So pinlock visor can prevent this. Um, we talk about the pinlock visors in the safety helmet discussion on a CVT element A. I personally now will not buy a helmet with a visor that hasn't got the facility for a pinlock. So this video is a very short one. I'll show you the difference between a non-pinlock visor and a pinlock visor. Make up your own decision what you want to go and buy. Give it a thumbs up. Comment away below. Um, subscribe to the channel please. Does does uh, help us make more videos. Um, what we have here is a standard safety helmet with a standard visor. Um, there is no facility to put a pinlock visor in this helmet. What we have here is a safety helmet with a pinlock visor. And as you can see, on each corner, on each side of the helmet, a couple of little notches where you can fit in a pinlock visor. So when you buy um, your helmet, make sure that you have the facility to put a pinlock visor in. And it's just like, um, all I can describe it as a double glazing. So there is a seal uh, and you can um, attach it on the inside of your visor and it does prevent um, steaming up, fogging up. And I'm gonna demonstrate that to you now. So this is a helmet without the pin lock. And if I bring the visor down, and uh, within a very short uh, space of time, whilst talking with you, the visor will start to steam up on the inside. And that's just through normal breathing and when you're outside in the rain, you will find that um, once it uh, steams up, you're not going to be able to um, see where you're going. Now, traditionally, what you've had to do um, in order to stop the visor steaming up is lift it up a little bit for the visor to de-steam and it doesn't take long for it to de-steam but that's you know that's what we've put up with over the years okay so swapped over the helmet now I've got the helmet with the pinlock facility so down she goes and I could um, quite happily talk to you now for a number of minutes and as you can see the visor does not steam up. Now with the pinlock visor if it decides to start to steam up um, first thing is to take it out give it a clean and reseal it. If it continues to steam up then uh, time to replace it but can you see around the outside of the seal uh, the steaming up but within the seal within the area that it's sealed that's where your sort of a double glazing effect takes it so it does uh, aid you so if you're on the bikes or you're around definitely worth investing in a pin lock visor Okay, so that's the differences. Um, make up your mind what you what you think. Um, as I said before, comment away below. And uh, but um, hopefully now you'll have a better idea, pinlock or non-pinlock. So thanks for watching. Bye for now.